In this video, I'm going to provide you with one type of stair stringer layout and design. This particular one will use a hanger and will be connecting to a stair landing. And you can see right here that I've laid it out. I just continued my layout um, on the stair stringer and made the necessary marks and adjustments. And again, I'm not going to go into a lot of detail. Sometimes a picture is worth a thousand words. And this is what I'm hoping you will be able to get from this video. Now let's take a look at the actual construction of this particular stairway. And here you can see that the stairway, um, the stringers are actually budding up against the landing. Um, they are not sitting on top of the landing, nor are they notched. These are not notched stringers. Let's go ahead and take a look at it from the other side. And you can see here that the stringers are budding up against the landing. And it's actually a beam. It uh, required, I think, a four by eight um, beam for the stringers to butt up against. It was actually part of the plans. So um, you can see the hangers. You've got uh, two hangers, one on the far right, one on the center. And of course, there is no hanger on the stringer on the far left because it will get a wall built underneath it. The wall will help to support the stair stringer on the left, so it will not need a hanger. So again, just to recap everything, you should be able to take a look at the pictures and um, figure out whether or not you can use this type of a method and use these pictures and illustrations or I should say pictures there are no illustrations in here should be able to use these pictures to get a pretty good idea how to um, lay out and cut um, stair stringers for hangers and again I can't provide you with um, you know a one one method I can't provide you with one method that will work for everything this method will work for this type of stairway. You will need to adapt and modify it to make it work for others.